Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating pages, numbers, and Keynote plus iMovie. All right, so let's just get down to this. On your Mac, you guys will see the App Store. If you guys don't see the App Store down here, don't worry. Just go to the Apple logo right on your top left-hand side and choose the third option where it says App Store. In there, you guys will see Featured, and then the very last tab says Updates. So you guys are supposed to see these updates right here. You guys, all you guys have to do is click Update. These updates are not huge, so they will be pretty fast. Look at 30 minutes maximum to update them all. For most of you, this will take 10 minutes, and that's about it for all of them. Now, if you guys don't see the updates right here, for example, let's do iMovie. Let's say we don't see an update here. All you guys have to do is click up here where it says search and type in iMovie. Whoops, iMovie. <laughs> there we go. All right, so you guys will see iMovie right here. Now, if you guys still don't see update right here below iMovie, let's just go into it and you guys should see update right here. Okay, so once you guys click on update, it's going to update your iMovie and that's it. Okay, and that doesn't just go with iMovie, it goes with anything, for example, pages. Let's say you guys don't see the thing right there, just click on pages, find pages, you guys can click update from here. Just make sure to be signed in to your Apple ID, okay? So as long as you guys are signed in, you guys will be able to update. Usually, even if you're not signed in, it's usually not a problem, you guys are are able to update but um, if you guys still see more problems and don't see the update don't worry about it sign out from your Apple ID sign back in in your store and that's it anyways hopefully this helped you guys out I'm gonna click on update so you guys can see exactly how big each update is and um, this will just be focused on your internet speed so if you guys have slow internet speed this will take longer if you guys have really fast internet speed obviously this will take seconds for example i actually don't see anybody taking seconds just because although you may have the best internet speed in the world the servers are not there just yet to give you all these updates just in seconds however they will be pretty small as you guys can see, iMovie is only 238 megabytes. You're looking at numbers, which is only 55 megabytes. Well, basically 56 megabytes. Once the app actually updates, it's gonna wait a little bit until it actually installs. That goes mostly for iMovie, which is a little bit bigger of an update than numbers or pages or Keynote. So here we can see that Keynote's only 68 megabytes. And Keynote is at 69 megabytes. Again, this will just take you guys minutes for most of you. If you're stuck there two hours or so, it might be time to just disconnect from your Wi-Fi network, connect up again, and see if this will restart just fine. Um, like I mentioned, iMovie is the only one that you really have to kind of wait for it to install the update. The other ones will install the update pretty fast. And if you're updating all these at the same time, like I am, then yes, it's going to wait for one to install the update and the other one and so on. So it might take you a little bit longer than just a minute to install all the updates. Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.